Kenya is in the League of African Nations, enjoying a robust and dynamic economy. With every passing year, more and more Kenyans are moving away from the traditional ways of conducting business to the modern trends of creating wealth. Thousands of retail investors are turning to the capital markets for investment opportunities. The phenomenal growth witnessed in our capital market has led to the introduction of new products to suit investors of all categories. One such product is a collective investment scheme, CIS, in which individuals give their money to professional fund managers licensed by the Capital Markets Authority to manage it on their behalf as a pool. Collective investment schemes provide a structure through which uh, investors have an opportunity to pool their investments and in the hands of a professional regulated fund manager. That way they have the confidence that their investment decisions are being effected, are being coordinated by someone who one not only has the professional capacity but is also su subjected to an appropriate level of supervision to make sure those investment decisions are being made in the best interest of the ultimate investors in the CIS structure. Investor education seeks to ensure that as we develop new products the investors also get awareness that these new products have been developed so that they can take up you know, this new product. Collective investment schemes are the ideal investment vehicle for investors seeking exposure to the financial markets. They are suitable for all investors, large and small. They include individuals, pension funds, companies and government institutions. When you look at the different players within the Leicester investment scheme. You have, for example, in a unit trust, you'll have a trustee who takes the ultimate responsibility for ensuring effective oversight of the coordination of the CIS business. You have the fund manager who has the primary responsibility for making the investment decisions and guiding the trustees and reporting to the trustees on the manner in which they intend to manage the pool of investments. You have the custodians whose primary responsibility is to ensure the safe custody of all assets that are being held, be it in cash or be it in securities, in that CIS, so that you have effective levels of checks and balances between the different players to ensure that at all times, the best interests of the ultimate investor are being catered for. To participate in a CIS, one should open an account with a duly licensed fund manager identify the risk appetite and duration to inform choice of pool for investment, review available investment options and make an informed decision in line with the risk appetite. Collection investment schemes are open to all investors of all classes and all sizes. It is, from the perspective of authority, it makes it, it provides a much more transparent, effective tool for investment and through the access to the licensed fund managers who are required to disclose the nature and scope of collection investment funds they manage, the different pools of funds that are available for investment. It then allows investors to go to these professionals, choose what their risk appetite is, allocate their resources as against that risk return profile, and then enjoy the returns over time. In a CIS, Investors receive units in return for investment with a clearly defined time frame in which to maximize returns with acceptable risk exposure. Other benefits include spreading investment risk over a broad range of assets, professional management, convenient record keeping and administration, affordability as they benefit from economies of scale by sharing costs with others, tax benefits. Income accruing to registered collective investment schemes is tax-free. The objective is to encourage pooling resources from small investors to boost the demand for securities in the capital markets. A collective investment scheme set up by an employer for purposes of receiving monthly contributions from tax emoluments of employees and investing them primarily in shares traded on any securities exchange operating in Kenya shall be exempt from income tax. One of the most primary benefits of pooled investment through our CIS 
are the opportunities for diversification of risk. As an investor investing in any one counter, you'd be carrying all the risk that attaches to the one company you're investing in. But when you invest in a collective investment scheme, you're investing in a pool of much wider investments. So not only are you able to acquire a larger proportion of any one investment, but also the risk is sufficiently diversified across multiple classes, as well as multiple natures of securities, which effectively reduces the risk and potentially increases the reward that can be enjoyed. By tapping into these products and services, small, medium and large-scale investors not only recap personal benefits but also participate in the growth of the national economy. Capital Markets Authority promoting capital markets integrity.